नमस्कार आई एम डॉक्टर अभिलिप्स आचार्य नियोनाटोलॉजिस्ट एंड पीडियाट्रिशियन कंसल्टेंट मणिपाल हॉस्पिटल भुवनेश्वर सो टुडे आई विल टॉक समथिंग अबाउट वर्ल्ड प्री मैच्युरिटी डे यूजली इट इज सेलिब्रेटेड ऑन सेवेंटीन ऑफ नवेम्बर एवरी इयर सो दिस इयर्स थीम इज स्मॉल एक्शन एंड बिग इम्पैक्ट मीन्स इमीडिएट स्किन टू स्किन केयर फॉर एवरी न्यूली बर्न बेबी एवरी वेयर सो आज ऑल ऑफ अस नो दैट नाउ इट इज ड्यू टू दी ड्यू टू दी ऑल आर्टिफिशियल रिप्रोडक्टिव टेक्निक और आई वी एफ्स एंड ऑल ड्यू टू दैट नाउ इट इज नंबर ऑफ प्री मैच्योर डेलीवरीज हैव इनक्रीज सो टूडेज इन टूडेज लाइफ वी नीड टू फोकस ऑन न्यूनेटल केयर मोलियन प्री टर्म केयर सो प्री टर्म केयर ए गुड प्री टर्म केयर स्टार्ट्स एट बर्थ and i would rather say ki just before delivery with a good antenatal checkup and with a prediction of premature delivery and once a imminent premature delivery is predicted immediate antenatal steroids and antibiotics if needed and for neuro protection there are injections are also available which gynecologist can recommend for the better neuro development of the premature babies so as soon as a premature baby is born a good resuscitation by a expert team is very very important including a good thermal care and a golden hour management with a good respiratory support so once the newborn comes to the nicu then there comes the intensive care of that baby so during this intensive care period a good nutrition is very very important like early availability of mother's breast milk and parental nutrition including the uh, lipids and proteins which is important for growth of the internal organs and very very important the brain development is required so apart from this uh, nutrition i would like to uh, uh, give stress on the infection control management as this premature babies are very very immunocompromised and they are at a very high risk of getting infection so we need to very very cautious inside the neonatal intensive care unit so that various dreadful infections are getting prohibited and very judicious use of antibiotics is needed for this premature babies because as they are they tend to stay inside the nicu for days together and some babies rather months together so aaj all of us know the fetus or a baby as before delivery it grows maximally uh, in third trimester that is between 28 weeks to till the full term gestation or 40 weeks at the expected date of delivery we usually do various screenings like rop that is for retinal checkup for retinopathy of prematurity and in between different screening for ultrasound of the brain to look for the brain development and on in uh, holistically we see the overall growth of the baby and the neuro developmental outcome so uh, when a baby delivers at 25 to 26 weeks of gestation normally we discharge those babies around 36 to 40 weeks of gestation but the follow up of this babies are very very important so these babies has to be followed up frequently in the high risk c- clinic a uh, very very frequent dental to look for any associated or any other symptoms needed so these babies maximum they should be getting they should be followed up till 5 to 6 years of age or till the preschool age group as the premature brain is still growing and we need to see ki what are the challenges those babies are getting when they are being grown and if any challenges are there we we see any challenge a child is facing as a baby born premature we need to correct with early intervention methods so we we say ki timely follow up and regular checkup of this premature high risk infants in the pediatric clinic routinely has to be done